Now, my little ones, I'm going to tell you a story. I'll get it. OK, George, now throw the airplane as far as you can. <laughs> Pepper, George, something came in the post for you. Grandpa Pig has sent Pepper and George some sunflower seeds and a letter. What does the letter say, Mummy? It says, Dear Pepper and George, Here are some sunflower seeds to grow in your garden. Plant these in your vegetable patch and I will plant some in mine. Let's see who can grow the tallest sunflower. Love, Grandpa Pig. That sounds fun. I am going to grow a sunflower as tall as Daddy. Come on, George. <laughs> May the best sunflower win. <laughs> Don't forget to wash your hands. Wash, wash, wash your hands. Wash them nice and clean. Bubbly, scrubbly, scrubbly, bubbly. Wash them nice and clean. Look, George, it's growing. Oh, yes. You're going to make a lovely sunflower. Look, George, our sunflowers. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> George, you're supposed to water the sunflowers, not me. These are coming along quite nicely. Pepper and George's sunflowers have grown very <laughs> tall indeed. Oh, Pepper and George, these sunflowers are beautiful. Let's take a picture to send to Grandpa Pig. Wonderful. Now let's wash our hands before we go inside. <laughs> Did you hear that, Granny Pig? I think it's your phone, Grandpa Pig. Oh, it's a picture of Pepper and George's sunflowers. Come look, Grandpa Pig. Splendid. Pepper and George's sunflowers are much taller than mine. Let's send them a picture so they know they have won. There. Perfect. It's for you, Pepper and George, from Grandpa Pig. He says, Well done, Pepper and George. You've grown the tallest sunflowers. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>